Have a seat, Mr. Holt. Hello, my name is Dr. Wienerdorf. I am a psychologist here at the Institute for the Strange and the Weird. Are you comfortable, Mr. Holt? No, you have these stupid bright lights in my eyes. And my bowels are about to explode from eating Taco Bell burritos last night. We want you to be comfortable, Mr. Holt. So go into the bathroom and do your business. I hope that went well for you, Mr. Hulk. Good for me. Well now, back to business. We have been notified by unknown sources that you have a strange problem. I don't have any problems! Calm down, Mr. Hulk. We are just here to ask you some questions to see if that is a problem. And what if I don't want to answer your stupid questions? Well then, Mr. Holt, things could get quite messy. What do you mean by messy? You got to meet Jethro when you were brought in, didn't you, Mr. Holt? Yes. Why? If you don't answer, Jethro will take you to a special room with this. So what? I love peanut butter. But would you love it if we forced you to eat this? <coughs> Take it away. Take it away. I'll answer your questions. Good, good, Mr. Hulk. Now you see we are not playing here. Yes, yes, I see that now. So I do see you have a weird issue with peanut butter. Something we have never heard of before. Okay. Yes, yes, I guess. You love peanut butter, but not in certain ways. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Well, let's just start with this spoon issue. Peanut butter on a spoon grosses you out? Yes, I can't eat it like that. And seeing someone else eat it like that makes me want to puke. But you can eat chocolate or most anything else off of a spoon, and you're okay with that. Yes, yes, I don't have a problem with that. Don't you find that somewhat strange, Mr. Hulk? I don't know, maybe. What about peanut butter and jelly sandwiches? Do you enjoy those? Yes, I love them. But isn't it true that you can't eat them if they're mixed together first? You have to put the jelly on one slice of bread, then the peanut butter on the other slice, and then put them together? I'm sorry. I don't see a problem with that. The problem is, Mr. Hulk, is that it's weird. Big deal. What about licking your fingers or seeing someone else do it? Do you have a problem with that? <coughs> stop! Please stop! Don't talk about that! <coughs> okay, okay, Mr. Hulk. We will stop this. We can see it's very upsetting. 
Thank you. <coughs> Thank you. Thank you. We will take you back to your car now, Mr. Hawk. We want to study our interview for a few days, and we will be in touch with you, Mr. Hawk. Do you now believe you may have a problem, Mr. Hawk? Yes, I believe I may. Good, good, Mr. Hawk. That is the first step to solving this problem. We believe we may be able to help you now. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Hawk. We will be in touch. The story you have just seen is true. We at the Institute for the Strange and Weird are here to help 24-7. You can contact us at 1-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-0-